here's some tips on how to make sure you give me the correct blog link. So once you've started your science blog and you've got your seven random facts that are true about you post all done, you're going to get this blog link one. And it says time to share your blog link. So when you go to continue, it says give me the link to your science class blog so that I can put them all together so you can start reading each other's. And it says click here if you don't see the form below, but oh, I see the form below. So I'm going to put my name test one because that's my name and it says copy and paste your blog's link and it should look something like this not blogger.com or else you know it's wrong so I'm gonna open up a new tab and I usually type in blogger.com and it gets me right here so I can see all my posts I'm gonna pick um, actually I'm not even gonna pick a post I'm gonna go right down here to view blog see those of you who copied this that's an example of what does not work. So you have to click on view blog. And this is your blog link. Now look at the difference. If I click on a post, the post link is longer because it includes all this extra information. So I just want to click on my blog. I just want the blog link. And I do control C to copy. I come back here and I do control V to paste. Notice the difference. I didn't write words there. I didn't put blogger.com. I put https colon slash slash my blog, science blog mine, dot blogspot dot com. Boom. Now when I submit this, it tells me your response has been received. So I go over to assignment. Always go over to assignment. Tell me you did it. I submitted my blog link. Let me know you did it. And then when you go to submit, I will actually get the correct link. Now, if you did it wrong and you're getting this message, go back here, go back to task, and fill out the form again, and this time give me the right link. And then I'll be able to share your link.